Warning. This glitch compilation is not a review, and not an indicator of the game's overall fun factor, but a testament to the general state of this game's technical side. Which is definitely, absolutely dreadful. Hello, I am the ghost of a long-perished quality assurance tester, and I am here to guide you through the world of Greedfall, where nothing is given, and everything is earned, especially the ability to walk. As a player character, you have been blessed with the power of bicycle legs, but even that won't save your ass from a four-foot metal fence. And while you might confuse this game for Assassin's Creed because it's about as well made, there is no climbing here, so the only way out of this trap is loading a save. Oh, I see you're stuck again, dumbass. Can't you see that you clearly can't fit through this huge gap? Time to load the game again. Boom, and you are loaded right back into the trap. Game over, thanks for playing. I'm sorry, to make amends for the previous glitch, I will now grant you the ability to be the best ventriloquist in the world. Good day, good day. What is that guy doing? No, really, what the fuck is he even supposed to be doing? Typing on a keyboard? Just a river with a faulty light bulb. Oh no, the game is falling apart! The curse of the broken pathfinding is spreading further and further. Now it's affecting the animals as well! That deer just crossed the dimensions, and this one is a fucking pinball. I have to go now. My planet needs me. The brains of the NPCs are about to short circuit. Hurry, destroy them all! I guess we found out his weakness. Bullets. That battle was absolutely epic. It sure was. Well, there are other hostile assholes on this island aside from the glitchy wildlife, but luckily, like everything else in this game, the bandits are incompetent as fuck. <laughs> that battle was absolutely epic. One kick. Two kicks, three kicks, four kicks, five kicks, six kicks, seven kicks, eight kicks, nine kicks, ten kicks, eleven kicks, twelve kicks, thirteen kicks. Okay, that's enough. Now it's his turn. Please don't stare. It's just a guy shoving a 50 pound metal mace into his pocket over and over and over again. Wow, we went on quite an adventure, didn't we? And at this point, anything more messed up than a teleporting ghost deer can't possibly happen to us. Wait. Is that a tea posing bird? There's a fucking line, spiders, and you just crossed it. 